This segment brought to you by Kansas Regenerative Medicine Center. Your stem cells, your health, your life. And we're back again. This is The Round Kansas. And, of course, it's a show about people, places, and things that make Kansas a great place to live and work. And instead of traveling through, stop and see something. Absolutely. Yeah. Get off the highway. Just go take a look at things. If you need to know where to stop, we can tell you. We're experts at telling people where to go, aren't we, Frank? Of course, she's been to all of them. I, yeah. I've been to most of them, yeah. <laughs> I, I have been uh, very blessed, very blessed to know some wonderful people all over the state, visit people, visit some cool places, some, some history that you just can't make up, you know, so it's yeah. a... It's interesting. Hmm. And one of the most interesting people and one of the people that I have to say I have been hugely blessed to know is Melissa Jarbo, who is head of the Military Veterans Project. And I've um, been fortunate to work with Melissa on some projects, um, the Ride for the Fallen. Um, but there's just so much that Melissa does. And she's just one of the people that I admire and respect most in this world. And Melissa is one of those people that... Um, you know, circumstance created a really difficult situation for her. And rather than, than um, sit around or be defeated by that or overcome by that, she has dedicated her life to making it better for other people. Hmm. And she's just amazing. So when we talk about spring coming and energy and, and all those positive things, that's something that Melissa manifest tenfold is just energy and a positive nature and this can do so i'm just so thrilled to share her with those of you that don't know her already in april 2011 staff sergeant jamie jarbo was serving in the zawari district of afghanistan when he was fired upon by a sniper with an ak-47 the bullet penetrated staff sergeant jarbo's spine leaving him a quadriplegic and paralyzed from the chest down. Staff Sergeant Jarbo never gave up the fight on the battlefield, nor did his wife once they returned to American soil. Jamie and Melissa spent the next 11 months inside seven different hospitals. Through it all, their love for country and fellow service members kept alive the dream of one day going home to Kansas and living happily ever after. In March 2012, doctors told Melissa that her husband was terminal and that she needed to place him in hospice care. Facing his final duty, Jamie told his wife never to forget he loved her and the girls and finally to take care of his fellow soldiers. In the months preceding Jamie's death, Melissa launched the Jamie Jarbo Foundation, now the Military Veteran Project, a nonprofit which honors and empowers military veterans. The foundation's mission is funding the most promising research to find cures for post-traumatic stress disorder and traumatic brain injury to assist with suicide prevention. While that mission sounds noble, the reality is much more so. Melissa, in honoring her husband's wishes, gives veterans and their families hope. She helps them navigate a daunting system. She listens, she acts, she cares. Melissa said, each day I choose to wake up, give thanks to God for creating such a man to show me what true selfless sacrifice is, what dedication to country meant, and open my eyes to a world of caring for others. Valley Vet Supply is devoted to providing information and professional quality products at reasonable prices. Valley Vet. 